Hey, Mr. Technopath, get on the Somewhere. Well, 15 minutes ago, he responded, so. <laughs> yeah. I mean, he, he was, well, actually, like, an hour ago, he's waiting on food, so. Could be he's eating. Am I not here? No, you're here. Eric isn't here. I'm oh. sending him with Coke gift, so. Or is he still naked running around somewhere? <laughs> For those of you yeah. who are in the game and have not done so yet, go ahead and roll initiative. Ah, oh, fudge. I try again for a better score. I'm just kidding. <laughs> I'm happy to have double digits. <laughs> There's my crit for the night. Great. Wait, we finished with that from the start? Sorry, I wasn't there. Are... <laughs> uh, yeah, you're rolling initiative because last time you guys revivified a uh, Manticore and a Black Dragon. Wait, we don't get a chance to run away? I thought they were both sleeping or something. They are. Mm -hmm. You will have a full round of which you guys can do stuff. I recommend we run away. <laughs> I know I don't know. had a plan for what he wanted to do. No, I have no plan. I have planned before, possibly a plan for after, but I think it was uh, pretty tempting to kill. Also, because I am not, uh, I don't actually, I can't actually see, I can't find my icon to roll initiative. Oh, I see your icon. Yeah, you might need to zoom out and zoom in. Yeah, yeah. No, 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 I have no vision, so I can't actually see anything, so I can't oh. find my token. Ah. Can I find feet of vision? Yeah, you can. Or one. Oh, now I can see. Okay. Okay. I wasn't sure because whenever I go, like, open the thing, I'm always in the exact middle of the screen. So I have to find my token usually. Yeah, I don't know. So, we just need. So Eric's on the call. Yes, he needs to roll an initiative. Yes, he does. But he needs to join the game first. Oh, yeah, that that, that too. Technicality. Either that or his uh, force powers are well beyond the rest of us. <laughs> <laughs> Eric, aka Ken, if you can hear me, roll initiative. And even if you can't hear him, roll initiative. Yeah, there's that too. Can't go away. Get the game over. Ah, go back, you dumbass. Go away. Yeah. Good enough. All right. Craig, what are you doing? Oh, so tempted to fight. <laughs> and as I, I don't know if everybody heard, but you guys get one round of actions before these guys 
which basically can do anything. Uh, I'm gonna I'm gonna look at the uh, um uh what's his name Lockhart and kind of do a motion for attacking. <laughs> I don't know what we're doing. Are we? Talking? I mean, no, it's really up to you. You are the probably the most reckless of it, of us who most likely attack attack without consulting with the rest of the party. I'm the only party I don't know how to play my character. <laughs> I am, I, that's I, what I, am I wrong about that? I'm just, can you no, I'm definitely, I've definitely run away from fights to start with. So I am spinning my sword around. I mean, I'm salty. I'm ready to eat my own guts and ask for seconds. <laughs> I don't know if, if I move here, will I get advantage on attacking the dragon? Mm, yeah. Am I? Am I going to be pushed back? Why it's my turn because I'm on the dragon currently? Uh, potentially. Okay, I'm just, I wasn't at, I mean, like, just my icons currently on it. I mean, should I be off the dragon right now? No. I, you're, you're I, I'm raging. Okay. Go ahead. And I'm going to hit him. Okay. Oh, grand. Okay. I don't wish I. Okay. But I believe. That but I know if Lachnar would have 34 distance to asset. Uh, probably not. That'll hit. Uh, it's 13 slashing, 6 radiant, and a few necrotic. So 15, 21. And second deck. Woo! There's that crit, baby. There it is. Hello! Huh. The other one actually should have been a crit. Uh, no. It shouldn't have. Uh, I accidentally have bless check. That's not supposed to be a check. Oh. That uh, first one was actually a 30 to hit. That still hits. Okay, so this one is a crit, though, because that was a bad one. Okay. 15. Oh, I gotta pull up the crit thing. Come on, Dave. What? I wasn't expecting this. I forgot about the fight. <laughs> it could have not been a fight. We could have talked it's like we talked to the gold, the bronze dragon, I think. Yeah, but this is a black dragon. Bronze. All right, let's see. 15. What do I want? I want slashing. Probably want slashing over at Chronic, because I think slashing does the bleed. Yeah, I think you're right. Roll your damage die twice and add them together, and the creature is bleeding for the next minute. The creature loses one d12 hit points at the start of each of his turn. Nice. Okay, so let's add in some extra damage dice. And oh, I forgot the product as well. Oh, time to math. Yeah, get out. 34 total damage. Oh, okay. And he's lacerated, so he takes 1d12 bleed at the start of each of its turn. Uh, I believe that is all I can do. Okay. Lockar, you're up. Uh, is tell me it looks like a legal move with the way things are positioned. Is that a legal move? Yes, sir. Okay. Um, let's see. We do this first. Uh, bonus action. Pull, ooh, let me make sure I've still got a bead. Sorry, I could have looked at this before, but I just remembered I've got that necklace. E equipment. No, oh, I see it's on my note page. I mean, you're gonna you're gonna bless everyone now. That was gonna happen. Gonna bless a, a three anyway. Crayon campaign. That's the one I want. Sorry guys, I have this sheet open. Right. I have not. Yeah, I used all my blessings. Um, all right. No matter, 
I will first level bless. Disregard. I don't have that spell in my list any longer. I'm just going to attack. How about that? I'll just shut up and attack. Sometime today would be nice. Why is it coming through? There it is. Uh, 21 to hit. 21 does, in fact, hit. Oh. Well, that would have been nice, wouldn't it? Second attack. 27. 27 does hit. Oh, of course. Looks like, did that roll correctly? It did. 13 points of slashing. And I'm going to put a smite on that as well. I've got a second level smite. So give me Trey. 16 uh, radium. Okay, so I have 26, 36, 42 points of total range. Uh, no. Two, 13 slashing. Uh, you said the first one didn't hit. The 21 didn't hit. No, I, the 21 did hit. Oh, my mistake. Yes. I, I Sorry, I, I heard you say it didn't hit. No, that's fine. So, yes, you're correct. Okay. Well, in that case, I'm going to, the first one hit, I would put a smite on that one as well. Okay. And another 12 radiant. Okay. And I'll be done. And Craig, Ten. roll your 12. Your D12 for his turn. Okay. Dragon's turn. I thought you said we had a free turn, a free round. He, he still takes it on his turn. Right. It's basically a surprise round, what it is. Right. So he's still going to take that. Yeah. Two bleed. Oh, okay. And you're up. Uh, I'll, I'll do, okay, I have a few questions. How, how, how tall is this room? Uh, the ceiling in this room is 40 feet tall. Uh, I'm trying to, uh, let's see. Let me reread this spell again. Work. Woodwork. Okay, cool. Uh, how big is this creature? Like, is he still is he still curled up? I guess would be the question. And how big is he? Uh, well, it is a huge dragon. All right. And he is in the process of mid unfurling. So you're saying he's about twenty feet or? Fifteen feet? Uh yeah. Oh so he's between are you saying it's between fifteen and twenty feet? Yeah. Alright, cool. I'm gonna I'm gonna use this then. Let me add this to my spell list so I can cast it. As soon as they let let me do anything, all right, cool. Oh. I'm gonna cast Wall of Force. <laughs> okay. Oh, yeah, you have that Force Shield. Yep, I have Wall of Force. <laughs> um, I'm gonna, I'm not gonna use the dome. What I'm gonna use is the ten foot, uh, the ten, ten by ten foot panels. 
And what I'm going to do is basically Lego him in so so he can't, like, fly or move or anything. Does that make sense, Anthony? Wait, am I trapped inside this? Yes. No. I mean, I could. I mean, I could make a dome and trap you inside there with him. Um, but, no. <laughs> okay, so... Trap him inside. Um, let's see. Yeah, because each fo- each each panel, there's ten of them, and they're ten by ten. They just have to connect with one another. Right. So, if he's only about twenty feet long, I'm basically gonna let me start drawing. <laughs> yeah. Or right. okay, yeah. So basically, I'm gonna as best as I can describe, like, come, I need. I need to get the snap on now. Um, basically, they do 10 foot, then do like a 10 foot here, then do a 10 foot here, and then start building until until he's kind of just trapped and can't move. <clears throat> he, he, all, all thing I can't really stop is his head, but I can keep him from like getting up and attacking with his claws. Or I can oh. trap his head in and let, leave his tail wiggling around. You know, now that I speak about that one, Travis hit him. Yeah, I guess to capture his acid. So, yeah, like, ten, ten, ten. <laughs> I mean, I doubt you, there's some doubt that, that you know, he can't just lower his head. No, oh, he's he's trying to get up right now, and I'm, I'm, I'm bopping this on him before he gets up. Oh, okay. Yeah, and remember, they're 10 feet high, and he's still laying down. Oh, okay. At first, I thought you were just going to create a wall to save you and Aurora. I am pinning him down so he can't move, he can't fly, and he can't, use, he can't like, turn his head and look at different people and spray his breath, basically. The tail... I'm letting the tail go, but he can start wailing his tail. I'm less afraid of the manicure than, than him. Mm-hmm. Okay. This is what I want you to do. Yes. I want you to draw the panels right. uh, that are on the same level as he is. You're right. In red. In red, okay. Panels that are above him. Draw those in blue. All right, so I'm going to have to change my color. One second. So red. So the ones that are the, fir- the like the the first level ones in okay. red, right? Yeah, the ones that are ground floor, red. All right, cool. Let's see, so that's 10 feet right there. That's a horrible drawing. One second. <laughs> okay, I can't click on it. Uh, we're gonna just deal with that. So red. So boop. 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 And I guess I should explain angles. So it'd be angled on him so he can't move. I am a horrible drawer, guys. I am sorry. <laughs> okay. And you said the blue panels? Oh dear. Lord, or, Eric. Right, which yeah, would be the panel. I tried deleting, and it didn't let me delete. So, if Anthony, you want to delete. <laughs> yeah, hang on. <laughs> if you want to delete, it won't let me delete. That was the first thing I tried to do. Then again, I can't draw a Oops. hexagon properly. Yeah. <laughs> Never drew a hexagon properly the entire time. Never been able to draw with a mouse. Like, like I'm bad at drawing, but you put a mouse in my hand and just say draw something. I'm like, mm-hmm. all right, cool. All right, Hang let's on. try this again. Use the polygon. Uh, the poly. I've you... never used the polygon line. Okay. Yeah. So, but well, yeah, I, but I have an idea. Like that? Yeah, that's cool. Alright. Uh. Wait a minute. Oh, okay. 
Okay, cool. Then I did something. <laughs> okay. I wasn't expecting it to connect. But okay. That won't work because <laughs> too much of his body will push those panels out. So uh, I don't think. Uh, is it is it immovable? Oh, the, the panels do not move. The, he is stuck there, and they're and they're nearly indestructible. So anyway, um, actually, see. okay, then actually, yeah. You better do a better drawing, because right now, he's not trapped. Yeah. <laughs> All right. Well, okay. Besides that diagonal draw line that was never supposed to connect, I don't know why it did. Uh, yeah. None of, none of your panels right now? All right. Basically, you would be pushing him out and pushing him into Garzuki and Craig. All right. So, boop, boop. Yeah, they can't... It, Basically, the lines can't go over his icon. Okay, there we go. That makes that makes sense. That goes over his icon. So boom, that's ten feet, right? Yes. All right, so ten feet, twenty feet. Well, yeah, you you're on the right path now. Yeah, right. ten feet. Why is it? I need to. I need to. The line is snap to center. Yeah. Ten feet. Twenty feet. Ten feet. All right. Uh, so it's that's four it's panels. panels. Three. That's four, uh, that'd be four panels right there. You're drawing a cube. Uh, I'm kind of drawing a cube, but um, then I'm got. So yes, Gorzugi will be caught. God damn it. Yep, boop. Okay, so that's the outside. Okay. So he has one more portion to run out of. No, he can't he can't squeeze out of that. That's fine. No, like he's five. talking about Gorzugi. And that would actually oh, put Lockar out. But Gorzugi has a way out. Yeah, that's fine. Oh, yeah. thank you. Yeah. And, and then, like... uh, okay, so th then I'm going to use, like, two more panels to go go across this direction, like that way, and so you can't get up. Okay. Yeah, does that make sense now? <laughs> it makes sense. You yeah. should be I aware that probably <laughs> still not going to prevent him from getting up. All right. Well, remember th that the that right there uh, is so it's basic. It's close to a dome, just with a hole for me to get out of. Yeah. And there's. I'm sorry for being in a bad position. I think I was standing on the goddamn dragon when we started. So um, yeah, that this. Uh, let me see. So I got that. So let me. I hate, I'm sorry. I'm taking so much time. So. We have. It's fine. I just I don't understand what you're trying to accomplish. He's trying to do it without putting house use that he can't get out of. It has like a little a little doorway that people can go in and get him. Um. Okay. Yeah. So it's let me get the pike online now. So right now, we, what we really want is an ink loop. Okay, cool. Now we got that, and we got you can have the idea of that ready. I'm just yep. doing a quick drawing. And from there, okay, so did you delete it? Okay, who is it supposed to be deleted right now? His draw, uh, Ken's drawings. That's kind of how I'm tramping your man. That's like all that's all ten squares just completely covered your man. Okay. And let me do a little freehand. I was freehand. And then this is the panel. Panels like blocking him in. Okay. 
Okay. <laughs> no, you shouldn't have done that. Devil! <laughs> that's, 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 that make a lot more sense now. <laughs> no. I'm putting him basically in a little igloo. That's the best way I can describe it. <laughs> Where people can get in and hit him, but he's too big to get out. Probably could, he could reach his head out, but not his whole body. Uh, yeah, that still prevents him from shooting his head in different directions and flying up. No, if you want to delete all that, Anthony, you can't. <laughs> can you just get rid of the scribbles? Yeah, the other lines were supposed to be blue, but they never changed them for some odd reason. Well, that's because that's your character's color. I changed it in the, the drawing portion. You can change it. Yeah. Okay. Oh. Huh. Blue. Huh. Yeah, it isn't changing. Oh, okay, that's how you do it. Okay. Complicated time. <laughs> okay. Anything else? Yeah, like I said, I just keep like I have this like little five foot little spot that our friends can get in and and out. And he's just kind of like shipping a bottle. <laughs> Uh, and that will, I'm gonna back up since that manticore is not ready. <laughs> oh, that's fine. You're, don't, you're not gonna try to defend Aurora? Oh, wait, Aurora can just run behind you, right? Aurora, it's your turn. Uh, yeah. Um. So. Is that going to work, or is going to be stupid? Either way, it's something. Yeah, actually, I was just going to rock farther away from the thing, so. You're not going to try to shoot one of them? Nah. I'm, I'm sure you can see the manticore and shoot it with a, at least an Eldritch Blast in this weight. Okay, I'll shoot it. I know, I'm just trying that. to make, I'm trying to figure out the, the efficiency. I mean, is there something else you're going to do with your action? I'm not going to aggro anything. So we're hoping that the Manticore is the one that will talk to us. And ask and maybe attack the dragon. Well, I thought our original plan was to, to get out of there and just set the other and they're on the on the dragon and like some uh, sort of battle. I could do just, if that's the case I could activate I could activate them all. No. No, no. just kill the ones we have. <laughs> yeah. But yeah, we've slashed it at probably real life, and there's three of us surrounding the dragon currently and I doubt I can run way far enough. Why do something with your turn, Hannah? If you have a buff spell of some sort, maybe think about that. If you don't want to draw aggro. But do what you want to do. Mm. Yeah. I have a buff spell, but I would have to touch whoever I give it. You could, as you pass Ken, you could cast it on him. If that, I don't know what your buff spell is. Uh, 10 fit points. Oh, uh, okay. Ish. 
You already know not to do the temp hit points on me. What? You know not. To, you already know not to do temp hit points on me. Not really. Yeah. <laughs> I was just no. I don't think. I don't necessarily know that, but I've never. Just, no, I don't think ten means really. Um. No. I'll use dissonant whispers. They're not dissonant whispers. Of uh, vicious mockery. On the uh, yeah. man of war. After the best part of man vicious mockery. Okay. Uh, uh, hang on just a second, guys. I'm gonna let a dog out. Okay. Sorry. Hold on. Yeah, that's cool. Uh, double ones. That sucks. Well, I mean, he also could roll above with the wisdom save throw, maybe. Dave crits on initiative, and you yep. get your double ones out of the way, so it's going its all good from here. Yeah. Well, I, I think maybe. Now I'm trying to figure out whether it would be better for me to activate my temp hit points or give you resist or give Gringrum resist. Gringrum? I keep thinking the dwarf is Gringrum. The dwarf is not Gringrum. I don't know where you're getting Gringrum from. Lokar. Lokar. Or give Lokar resistance to acid. Mm. <laughs> All right. Uh, like, I'm sorry my turn took so long, guys. It was really hard to explain that. <laughs> Did it make sense at the end is my question. Pretty much, you, it's just as obvious that you're really looking <laughs> for a specific outcome. And thank well, you for being... for a specific shape. <laughs> uh -huh. Thank you for considering that and not just letting me die within the, do in, within the Thunderdome. I, might just, I could have just dropped the dome, but then we wouldn't be able to hit it. And that would just temporarily... Then, yeah. Well, then that's temporary beat, up, beat, the, beat the manticore before you fight the dragon. But we would still have to deal with an angry dragon. <laughs> sure. But not uh, at the same time as a manticore was the assumption. Yeah, but it's still we're dealing with an angry dragon. Like, I'd rather have the dragon limited mobility where we can hit it and not have it bray its breath in any direction with my wall force end. I suppose I, did you use your bonus action to get temp HP or something? So yet? I already have it. Okay. Uh, I wasn't sure. Uh, no, I've had it for a little bit. I didn't take any damage in the last fight, so Cool, so at least you have your temp HP to keep your concentration. Is not something I'll worry about. Personally. <laughs> I could be wrong. It could be a super metaphor for all I know. I just don't know creatures yet. Alrighty. I'm back. Okay. I, I, I told Manticore that its mother sucks eggs. <laughs> its mother probably did suck eggs. Probably did, yes. Your mother has a fantastic cloaca. See, wisdom. <laughs> wow. <laughs> All right. I don't think I want to compliment his mother's butt. <laughs> and as that is the end of that combat round. Oh, yeah. You know, okay. disadvantage on his next attack. Two, two psychic. Two psychic. <laughs> I would have explained and said what I was doing. Oh, but, oh, what? Oh, 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 oh. Wait, why is that wakening? I thought we needed water. Oh, what? Yeah. what? No, no, no. Yeah. Why? <laughs> I'm okay, considering so just staying in the dome. I'm thinking about just staying inside the dome. <laughs> what? No. No. <laughs> No. Broke. <laughs> that moment when you realize you should have broke the other stones first. <laughs> I wanted to do that, but you know, it's people so gotta hard. do what people gotta do. What the? Wait, where did the water come from? Blood? What? 
Uh, the water was only the trigger for the dragon. What? But the, what was the trigger for the Manchester Corps? The dragon. The dragon. The dragon was the trigger for everyone. <laughs> it was a domino effect. Now, the good news I'm, is... I'm staying inside the dome. Is only the dragon and the manticore will actually have actions this turn. Wait, when was my turn? Uh, that's a good question. When was your turn? I thought he's not on the turn order for some odd reason. I, I thought I was on it. Dang it. Oh, no, you're not. <laughs> um, Come on, Dan. <laughs> you know, Can I have a now? Four. So you go yeah, ahead. Yeah. Go ahead, Ben. I'll get you added. All right. I don't. You would have been after yeah, me but anyway. They, they, I, we only realized that they animated it after my turn, right? That's correct. Uh, don't be mad up. Yeah, we are completely divided, y'all. Uh, <laughs> my turn, right? <laughs> no, it's my turn. Oh, I just panicked now because I have meta knowledge. So, 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 so I should cast Fireball in the right? active. Do you know what, what I would you do <laughs> inside the dome <laughs> with a small exit hole with a dragon? I would use just you know, this is I would use symbolic entity. At minimum, and run out of the hole and stand about here. Be honest, uh, if I can, let's see. So, ah. it, do I have to go up here, out there? Do I have to go up here, down here, then out to actually get it? Ah. Corn. Do I have to do that to get out, or is it... No, no, there's just an just... opening for yeah, right there. Okay. So one... Alright, why are you not working? I think that's my movement, I think. Okay. Well, uh, you okay. would have trouble getting past the Manticore. I thought it's still what? sleeping. It, no, the Manticore is... Uh, yeah, it, technically it is. It's not really asleep. It's it's awakening. Yeah. All right. I meant like it's not in a state to actually attack and stuff. I wasn't worried about the attack of opportunity. I'm worried about him blocking so big that he blocks you. Oh right. DM ruling. About what? Whether the magic core would block my move, my attempt to move no. past him. No, not at this point. Okay. This is you're, you're technically still in the surprise room. Okay. Anything else? Uh, no, I don't have a bonus action. All right, Craig, it's your turn. Well, Tony, before we start the round, could you go around the clock here? I can't remember what all the creatures are. A few of them I can easily identify, but just to clarify. Yeah, I got one. I'm still trying to get on the map, and I'm having a hard time. So. Okay. I am going I see to see an ogre go. and a fire giant. And I, thought, uh, I thought I broke the head off this one, didn't I? Yeah, we broke off two of them at least. And this one, the Medusa and this one, didn't I? Yes, you did kill the Medusa and one other. I can't remember what. You did not kill them. Yeah, we broke off their heads. Did that not kill them? That did not kill them. Oh, okay. Fuck. <sighs> Bye, guys. <laughs> Uh, I'm quite sorry that I accidentally found the trigger. I'm going to put the beholder in between me and that that scary snake lady, because I have a fear of snakes from the very first session. <laughs> <laughs> I can go recklessly attack the beholder. Fucking hell. Uh, I, doesn't a beholder have Freaking disintegrate instant death beams. Oh, yes. we're toast. Yeah. We are totally toast. Let them fight. <laughs> Run. <laughs> Just get out of sight. 27 to hit the beholder. I believe it will. That's 10 slashing, 7 necrotic, or 7 radiant, 4 necrotic. 
Uh, oh, jeez. A 19 will probably miss. Uh, hang on. Nope, that's a hit. Okay. Side Man. note. Lockar, if you ever wanted to use that special wind axe thing. <laughs> oh, I already got it planned. If you ever wanted to use that ability. <laughs> okay, so what's the total damage here? 61 between three attacks. All on the beholder? All on the beholder. Okay. Vegematic. Anything else? Um, I I don't know if we're running yet, but uh, I think we should if you have any understanding of what we're facing. We might fight each other. Uh, I'm done. Yeah, which is why we should run away and not give them the extra targets to not to chase. I don't think chase if they can fight. Uh, what okay. happens? What happens? Nothing for the Beholder this round, nothing for the Ogre Mage this round. Nothing for the... Oh, uh, yeah. Sorry, uh, Wade. You wanted to know what creatures were in here. Yes. Okay. So we will, of course, start with... Uh, let's see. I don't scroll too far. So Beholder, Dragon... Fire Giant, Manticore, Medusa, Mummy, Ogre Mage, Rakasha, and a White. Okay. Oh, shit. So you guys have fun in there. I think I'm going to go leave the temple now. Yeah, yes. let's try to get out. Where's the temporary? Where's the purple hole? We really need the purple hole. What we need is us to gather up and use the rod of security and let them fight. And <laughs> oh, that sounds like a fabulous idea. And it is Lightgar's turn. All right. So I got. They're all animated. Are any of them mobile? The dragon and the manticore are the two that are going to be mobile. Of course, the dragon okay. has a wall of force around it, so. Okay. All right. Um, I hear that we want to leave. <laughs> has anyone yelled this out yet? I haven't yet. This is this is player going like. No. All right. We're in initiative. Let's see. It looks like oh fuck. So yeah, I'll do that. I will reach to the back of my belt, grip my new battle axe, and activate the effect of steel wind strike. Uh, here, I'll pop that for you. Does that allow you any movement? It allows me, yes, for teleportation movement. So I will make my first attack to the guy to my south here. I think that's the Rock Sasha. Uh, let's see. That is correct. All right. Uh, now, the spell, if I, if I were to cast the spell, it would use my... Uh, melee spell attack. Do I use that or my melee attack with the weapon since this is weapon based? Uh, okay. uh, it'll be a melee attack. Okay. Let me go back here and do this. Come on. It's just all the rock slash to the south. Damn it, that's a miss. Yeah, I'm pretty sure. So there's one. And I will then teleport to there, hit the Manticore. Okay. That is the plan, anyway. 
23 to hit the Manticore. I believe that's a hit. Uh, it's one-handed, so... Yep, that's a solid hit. So, rolled a one on damage. Seven points of slack. Hold on, that's not right. That's 60-10. Let me go back here and do this right. Thirty-five points of damage. Nice. And then I'll turn and hit the fire giant, which would be attack number three. Oh come on! I'm sure, thirteen misses him. Oh yeah. So that's one, two, three, and then four will be on the beholder. Twenty-six to hit. That'll hit. And thirty-one points of damage. Okay. And then I teleport for number five to the ogre magi. And twenty-five to hit. Twenty-five will hit. For twenty-five points of damage. And the spell says I have to end within five feet of one of those that I attack, which I am. That's where I'm at right now. Okay. Can I kind of join us in the hallway with the, the three of us in this hallway? Uh, I don't want to leave Craig by himself. All right. Because I doubt he can get through there. They're all going to animate. But I'm done. Well, yeah, I'm done. Okay. Can't believe how many of those missed. Yeah, kind of annoying. Okay. One. Twelve. One. Two. Three. Four. Okay. The dragon, realizing its predicament, grabs a stone block out of the floor and starts to wiggle its way out of here. Starts, please. Starts. And that will be its turn. Leaving behind the wall that's still going to be enacted for ten minutes. Ken, it's your turn. Should I use my my reaction on the dragon or the the ogre magi? Good choice. If there's a chance I'll just kill the dragon. So no, I'm just kidding. <laughs> uh, so is the dragon within ten feet of me currently? Yes. I'll just do it on him. Let's see if he, he probably will succeed on his con. Alright, he gets three necrotic. Okay. Anything else, Mark? What? No, it's not my turn. I haven't done anything yet if you're talking to me. Okay. Yeah. Again, the dragon is escaping. Yeah, I know. I can already tell that. that. I didn't think it was a digging dragon. <laughs> oh. Just. Well, it is used to digging its own lair. <laughs> well, at least, uh, at least it, bought, it bought us some time instead of him just. And a wall in between us and the rest of them. Kinda. <laughs> Some people can see it, but I'm pretty sure as soon as that boulder looks towards that wall, the wall's gone. So, <laughs> I mean, a section of it, at least. <laughs> yeah, well, it'll be interesting to see what happens. Yeah. Well, it might not be around for much longer. I see I'm this. for the fireball. Yeah, yeah I've seen this situation, and it's pretty much kind of. I might nope my way out. 
Yeah, 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 ye
Oh, they're not good. <laughs> oh, hey, did the dragon take his default damage at the start of his turn? Oh, I forget. it did not. It took 12. Wow, nice. Okay. Uh, as for the beholder, 10 will get me roll your damage dice twice and add them together. So, one, two, three. All right, so that would make it. Are you going to take some attacks of opportunity to try it one way? Uh, well, first of all, let's see if I kill the boulder. That's 41 damage for the first attack. Okay. Still alive? Yeah. Second attack? Ooh! Yeah, baby, <laughs> you! <laughs> oh, oh twenty. Oh, uh, like a Cadbury egg. Your damage die twice. Roll on the major injury chart, and the creature's bleeding for the next minute. It loses two d eight hit points at the start of each of turns until wow. Okay, <laughs> that's time to max that damage twice. So <laughs> that's. Mm -hmm. Okay, you don't have the radiant, right? Uh, no, not this time, unfortunately. Okay, okay well, the bot oh, your necrotic is going to be... Uh, I'm good. He's using slashing. That might kill it. It might. It very well could. <laughs> you, guys, you guys have actually played a lot of damage on it already. 73 damage. Oh, yeah. Nice. <laughs> <laughs> it is a Cadbury egg. Split it right in half. Um, all right. Next attack on this ogre. Okay. Reckless. 18 to hit. That's a mess. Oh, okay. So, let's see. It's I'll take a deck opportunity. Okay. Bye bye. <laughs> yeah. Let's see. I like how I got an 18 to hit when I rolled a 5 on the dice. <laughs> you know that last crit? Was double twenties. Ah, so it was. Nice. You ain't roll three twenties in a row, man. That will hit me for fourteen blood to seven blood to eight. Hey Tony. Yeah. He just attacked somebody and he's within five feet of me. He just triggered my sentinel. Okay. <laughs> the first. 21 hit him. 21 does hit. The first crit was a 1 and a 19. Uh, 13 slashing. Okay. Okay. That's it for me. That was my reaction. And they're now going to die by Beholder. Oh, Beholder's dead. Oh, okay. For some reason, that didn't click with me. No, I I totally murdered that boulder. <laughs> okay. The ogre magi is going to cast a what spell. What level magi? Uh, if he makes an attack on me, it's a disadvantage, please. I'm displacing. Yeah, he's casting a spell. <laughs> Sorry? Oh. The Ogre Magi is casting a spell. Ah. Uh, against who, though? Yeah, that's a good question. 
against everyone. It's an AOE. <laughs> oh, where's the Ogre Magi at? Uh, next to Lockhart. Yeah, that's the one you took the attack, opportunity attack from. Okay. Oh, come on. Okay, Conjure Portal, if you want to have space, Portal has front X. Okay. Slotgar, you're the only one who observes this. But behind okay. the Medusa and the mummy, a shimmering portal opens. And those two get sucked into it. Goodbye. Oh, so wait, the mummy lord just left it. I, I can't I keep track of anything at the at the Gorgon. Yes. Okay. Oh. Uh, I did not want Gurzui dying again to a mummy lord. <laughs> <laughs> well, it might be gone for now. If that, if that ogre goes down, they might be back. <laughs> uh -huh. And you see the Rakasha spread down this hallway. <laughs> Which hallway? Oh, about ten o'clock. Hey, I'm pretty. I'm in a different. I'm in the hallway, so I, yeah, I can't see. Lockar, you're up. I shall disengage. Okay. Want? Oops, wrong tool. Sir so Robin has taught you well. Yes. Brave, brave Sir Robin ran away. I am redeploying to a better defensible position. Let's get it right. <laughs> <laughs> We're taking that ladder away. We're taking the ladder away from the tree fort. Exactly. Uh, so disengage and move. And I'm done. That's my action and my move. All right. Actually, I, I, and I would yell, we're running to the north to make sure the other crew knows what we're doing. Whether we hear it or not, a completely different story. <laughs> True enough. Yeah, at least me and Ken. Yep. And Craig, yep. Uh, as far as you can tell, the dragon has moved on somewhere. I kind of want to go back and fight it. Ken, it's your turn. No, I'm moving this way just to see what's going on. And that's a dead end, isn't it? Right here? Yeah. Yes? Yep. That is a... Yes. Basically, that's a killing pit. That's a killing pit? Uh -huh. <laughs> All right, this is a dead end, end over here. I am gonna hold an ability. Okay. <laughs> Under what condition? Under the condition we get attacked by an enemy. <laughs> what ability are you holding? Uh, I'm trying to figure that out. I'm probably gonna use one of my Rakshasa abilities. <laughs> Wait a minute, you're a rock, Sasha? 
He's he stole the soul of a Rasha. Yeah, I know. That. That's the first time he's admitted to it. <laughs> oh, okay. Sorry. I messed up. Well, I mean, no one can really hear me. I figured that's what the players asking me these questions. <laughs> but I'm in your head. <laughs> Did you get that teleport teleport telepathy? <laughs> yeah, you didn't know that was the other effect on that on that bad likes, did you? Ah, uh, who has the ring of wishes? <laughs> Technically, I think that's in uh, Craig's bag. Ring of wishes? Do we have? Well, that's right. We do have. Mm -hmm. Yeah, we do. <sighs> But yeah, that's. So what are you, what are you holding? Uh, so I'm just, I'm just, I'm looking up right now to see if this is actually a spell or ability. Just a little slow. You know what? No, I'm just gonna cast a spell. Ah, yes. Uh, and then I'll use my action to dash back next to Aurora. Okay. And that is my turn. Okay. Aurora! So we have to go back to where we came. That end. Got it. Um, yeah, it really is a dead on. It's not true seeing up. That's the plus side. Uh, okay. All right. I'm just going to have a Eldritch Blast ready in case an enemy comes within sight. Okay. And this is when I wish I, I had ready to okay. melt with stone. That's all. Okay. I might need to increase my Increase my removal. Uh, the side is being a tight corridor, which prevents the larger creatures from. Uh... <laughs> yeah. Most of them. Okay. Yeah. Well, actually, it only prevents one. All right. Manticore is not fond of undead. So he's going to smack the white. And only hits once. Gorzugi, you hear footsteps coming up from behind you. Okay, with that ten feet. Not yet. Okay, well, I don't actually see it, see it, so I'm just running to where I saw my allies. Okay. And I don't know. I really wish I knew. Yeah, I communicate. What? I thought you'd be farther by now. Is, do I get a response? Oh, wait. No. Yeah, they're standing. Yeah, the pair of them are standing right next to you. Uh, I'm just like, what? Is there a reason that we haven't gone farther? Yeah. Dead end. Oh. Grant! Any cracks in the wall that I could move through? I, I 
guys with gas. Mm, it's up to you. We'll find out. All right. Fire giants are not fond of ogre magis as they're competing. <laughs> So, Welcome whatever's following us is either huge or... Okay. Oh, nice. Hold a, hold a one. I got a 21. Sixty-six. There. Ogre Magi is dead. Oh, okay. Well, that means the mummy are probably coming back. Craig slash rule, you're up. Uh, it is Craig. I don't know why it's just his rule. Where does it say rule? In the initiative. Oh, okay. Uh, can I see the fire giant from here? Yes. Uh, I'm going to throw the spear at him. Okay. <laughs> nice. That was without advantage. <laughs> That was without advantage. Oh, shit. Scene. A 17 on a piercing. Roll your damage dice twice and add them together and roll on the major injury chart. Okay, so. Let's uh, leave the. That's 29 damage. Okay. That. Yeah. And let's get to the major injury chart. That is a major. He's crippled leg. The creature's movement speed is reduced by 10 feet and has disadvantage on deck saving throws. All right. I just threw it at him again. <laughs> Holy shite. <laughs> you might be able to declare this. <laughs> yes. <laughs> if that only was you the one the that came to me. That fighter. Carrying the, the witch axe. That, yeah, that's why I was tempted to use it, but it's like, I've been getting a lot of items, and the paladin needs some love. Wow. <laughs> um... Yeah, that's uh, that was a crit. That that three levels of fighter is really paying off. Well, time to roll that d20. Fourteen. Fourteen piercing. What is that? Uh, roll your damage size twice, and then here and roll on the minor injury chart this time. Or we can frighten it with holy terror. Man, those secondary rolls are just killing me. <laughs> That's only 18 damage. Okay. Uh, and then on the minor chart. Uh, you know what? I'll take it as long as I can get those crits in. That is, injured arm, randomly determine one of the creature's arms that cannot be used to hold the shield, and the creature has disadvantage on any rolls involving the use of that arm. Doesn't he use, like, a two-handed sword? Yep. There you go! He's got disadvantage on attack rolls with it. And I guess it doesn't really matter which arm does it. No. Are you beating on the giant? <laughs> yes. Um. Wait. Uh, 
So you need to move up. That's fine. I have plenty of movement. Yeah, because you're making melee weapon attacks. Nope. It's the spear. I'm throwing the spear. It's listed as melee, but it's it's oh, technically okay. a it's a, it's a ranged it melee attack. Okay. What? Does yeah, it, it returns to my hands. Yes. Oh, right. Uh, I'm tempted to action surge. What are you saving Sorry. it for? I don't know. How bad does that? How bad does that uh, fire giant look? Not very. Doesn't look very bad. No. And of note, uh, you see no dragon cartons. He probably chased our friends down the hall. You know what? Screw it, yellow. Uh, I will action surge okay. and beat on him some more. This time I'll just use my normal ones uh, recklessly. Uh... Yeah. Holy shit! Yeah. <laughs> Three crits wow. in a row. That was off of another 19, too, on the second roll. Jesus. You may just save us yet. Let's see here. That's uh, slashing. Uh, nine on slashing. Roll your damage slash twice and add them together. Did you crit again? Yes, yes, he did. We he may be our savior. <laughs> and it may just be the Antichrist. That too. was forty two damage off of that one. Okay. That actually probably put a dent in his armor. That one uh, did, yes. Twenty nine to hit? Twenty nine will hit. Twelve twelve damage this time. And I still have my bonus action. See, I did that, so I'm gonna remove that. And oh yeah, I'll go ahead and attack the bonus action. Twenty-five to hit for eleven slashing four fold. Okay. How does he look? Now he's starting to look hurt. All right, I'm done. Okay. Mm -hmm. Oh, 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 oh. oh yeah, he's got me in his sight. I don't even know what that is. Like our Europe. Uh, unless I hear anything coming from the north, which I probably don't. You do not. I'm going to move to there. Okay. Still plenty of fun in this room. So I'll move to... There. Okay. And... Yeah, what the hell? Can't take him with me. I will bonus action pull a bead. Before you do that, uh oh, roll a perception check. I'm going to roll a perception check. That's what I meant to do anyway. A 19? Okay, at the limits of your vision down the hallway, you see the ass end of the dragon. I figured he was dead. Oh, yes, I do kind of see that. It looks like rock. All right. Noted. Uh, bonus action, I'm going to pull a bead and cast, uh, I think it's blinding spike as a bonus action, and concentrate for a minute. So that's the end of my turn. Okay. And you're up. Ten, is there a dragon?
And Ken is going to take this in the face. Okay. Just, wow. I wish I... It's been my... I just didn't think I should waste my... If I'd known it was the dragon, I would have given you resistance. And you succeeded. So at least it's try to. Oh, nice reaction. So you only take what a quarter of that? Yeah, I take a quarter of that. I've been talking the entire time. Um, yeah, so I take eleven. Okay. Which gets reduced down even further for other for temp HP reasons. All right. So, did it hit your actual HP? Yeah, but it hit me for three. So, you still need to roll a d10 concentration. No, no. But why not? Because I... Oh, yeah, that's right. I have the Expeditious Retreat. I was thinking of the... Oh, right. The... the whatchamacallit? The wall. But I'm not exactly too worried, because... <laughs> Expeditious Retreat's gone, just because that's the one number I could roll to fail it. But, that means I don't fail on something else, hopefully. Wow. Anything else? I mean, you, you, it blasted his breath weapon at me, so it's still my turn. <laughs> yes, I know. That's what I'm... Yeah. No, 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 I'm getting for it. I'm assuming... Last time I saw this thing, it was pretty beat up by uh, Lockgar and uh, and what's his face and uh, Craig. I always want to say rule, but Craig. Cool. I'm gonna have bonus action cast holy weapon. Okay. And then I'm gonna waylay into the pope. <laughs> I have no advantage on boo boo boo. It's a 21 hit. Um, maybe. And you should see a sword and you should have control of it. That again? There should be a sword next to you and you should have control of it. Why, why am I controlling it? Spiritual weapon? Uh. Uh, no, holy weapon. Or holy weapon? Yeah. Yeah, it's a buff. It's not a... Oh. Okay. <laughs> uh, 21 does not hit. 21 does not hit. All right. If you don't want to control it, I will. <laughs> yeah. <I'll... laughs> All right, cool. That's it. That's my turn. Oh, yeah. Aurora, you hear the sounds of what sounds Hi. like water dropping onto a grease yeah. fire. Okay, that's an interesting sound to hear. Oh, look, it's a thingy. <laughs> yeah. I guess I'm going to go use Eldritch Blast on it. Hmm? Uh, and hope I was hoping for something bigger. <laughs> <laughs> well, uh, okay. What was the, oh, the red bead was for bleeding, right? I see. Uh, 
have one still that I could use. I'm just reading it over again. I haven't looked at it in a while. Hmm. That's weird. Uh, well, I can try doing light on it. Um, yeah. So, but you have to run up to touch I mean, it to do that. That's ranged. Oh, it actually has some range, oh. Yeah. It actually yeah, throws far. Yeah, it has to have a bit closer, but yeah. Right right yeah, it's 30 feet, right. Yep, it's ranged. Yeah. Cool. For some reason, I thought it was touching. Yeah. I don't know why. It's right there. Yeah, I need to move like 10 feet. Yeah, it's like, I don't know if I have to hit it its body or its head, but I think it's like two squares up, and I'm definitely able to hit it with light. So, yeah. Okay. Where's the pop-up? Okay. Well? Yeah. That was unfortunate. Yeah, oh, it's the greatest. That's still a lot of damage. Yeah. Hooray. Okay. <clears throat> okay. Just so you're aware, doesn't seem to do as much damage as you would think it would have done. Oh. The product? It oh does. Lord. It does take some damage. But oh, that's right. My dragon. Oh, I thought Black Dragon was acid. <laughs> yeah, it only has acid. I thought it was acid. It's probably immune to acid. Yeah. Immune? Yeah, I would think so. But it's that's a special dragon. Yeah. 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 Is it an undead? It is, it is, is a actually black dragon. A, it is actually a. Oh, wait. Mm -hmm. Hang on. Hang on. I might be wrong. I may have had the wrong thing pulled up. Nope. I had the right thing pulled up. Okay. Wait. Why is we to find out it wasn't a black dragon, it was something else entirely. <laughs> it's a shadow uh, dragon. Okay, I gotta share a picture of what's on my screen just so you guys can get a good laugh. Uh wait, where, where are you sharing it at? I uh, think the server. Hang on, yeah. Apparently this black dragon's name is White. <laughs> okay. What? Let's see. White. Whoops. Not there. Oh, white. Oh, white. It's a, it's a unique oh, yeah. dragon. Nice. <laughs> oh, he's not. He's, so your melee attack would have acid damage on it, too. Oh, really? Yeah, but notice that it, the, it's the info for the black dragon, yet the name of the dragon is white. <laughs> oh, all right. But all Good the God. details are actually for a dragon. Okay. And it's, technically, right Ken, for a dragon. Yeah, Ken would have failed his... Uh, Breath weapon. Uh, I see. think. Yep, 18 is a different story. <laughs> yeah. Yep, I have nothing against this guy. Okay. 
But yeah, I was looking at this. I'm like, this looks weird. Uh, did you uh, did you pick this up from someone else or? No, this is straight out of Roll Twenty, the compendium. Yeah, it's just weird because it's immune to poison, but says nothing about acid damage. So I guess your absorb elements actually now matters that you did that you roll your acid damage. Well, no, I mean, with that, it's uh, I take uh, 11 more damage instead. Right. Oh. Okay. Anyway. Uh, let's see, it's the Manticore's turn, and it's killing that creature. Gorzugi, you're up. Okay. And realizing that I don't actually have... Looking at that sheet, I realize I have nothing, but I shouldn't use that meta knowledge. I mean, you already tried poisoning it once, and you probably would show it did nothing ah. to it. <laughs> no, I don't know that. Corey! Uh... Well, I mean, I could have been like, oh, that did not, that, that seemed to not have done as much as I thought it would. It's the matter of poison. Wait, did I not say that I activated the poison dagger during my run? Hmm. No, I meant to uh, activate your, uh, your symbiotic thing. Well, yeah, at the start, yeah, that's still active, of course. Mm. You know what? I just whip it. Be good. Nope. Unfortunately, right. that's a miss. Plus, can I move? And I actually, uh, I'll, I don't know. I should have just cast resistance acid to on myself. Sorry. I'll just stand my ground. Try to keep Aurora. All right. Ye old fire giant did not take kindly to getting whooped on by a crag. <laughs> Why not? I love it when crag whoops on me. <laughs> okay. Uh, arousal spankings don't count. <laughs> <laughs> Harder, daddy. <laughs> <laughs> Wait a minute, I have a wand of thunderbolts. Why didn't I use that? Uh, good question. Uh, next round. All right. So these are at disadvantage. They are, should be normal because I was uh, reckless. Oh, okay. So <clears throat> one. And two. That'll hit. And that'll hit. Ooh, that was some nice payment. Yeah, even with half, that kind of tickles. <laughs> hey, Tony. Yes, sir. He just triggered me. He attacked my uh, my companion. He's within five feet of me. Go Damn for it. it. What is with these low rolls tonight? Yeah, that's a mess. Four, yeah, <laughs> clang. That's all right. Craig's going to put him down. Strong enough for all the 20s. I will uh, recklessly attack him. Yeah, he's doing the Peter Griffin going, shh, shh, shh. It's okay. <laughs> 25 to hit. That'll hit. 25 to hit. 31 to hit. Craig's going to hit. Well, actually, would the first hit kill him? Uh, how much damage is it total? 23 34? No. All right, well, the second hit, kill him. <laughs> uh, let's see, 34 plus 16. Yeah. Yeah, actually, it would. <laughs> uh, I will then activate my second wind. 
Oh, uh, <laughs> oh, I see a dragon. Mm -hmm. I'll call you with the metacore and I'll take the dragon. You know, I'll stop here for now. That way it doesn't turn and just attack me right away. Okay. <sighs> Anything else? Uh, that's it. All right, Ken, you're up. My problem is, can I even hit this thing? Hey, uh, we just skipped over luck car. Oh, sorry. Luck car, go ahead. It's all right. Oh, I gotta get over here. <laughs> Move over here and see if I can hit this guy. Get over here and get advantage with me. <laughs> <laughs> Good God. 16 hit? That actually might hit. Really? Okay. That does indeed hit the mana core. Uh, 14 slashing. Okay. He's still up. Yeah. Yep, and the second shot. Another 16. Okay. For 17 slashing. Oh, and I've got a... Uh, okay. Uh, so that was, where was I? I was right there. So that was 10. So I still got 20. Oh, there was nothing else in that room, right? Everyone else has fled. Yeah. That's, yeah, that's correct. All right. I'll move to there then. It'll be done. Okay. Ken, you're up. Yeah. Uh, do I try to, I mean, this thing's still hurting, right? From the previous. Well, yeah, it's gotten head. It definitely got led by Craig. I actually been taking his D12 of uh, didn't, damage. Uh, oh, yeah, oh, I was going to check. Probably not. Point. Yeah, that's two rounds worth of D12s. <laughs> or three rounds at this actually, point. Actually, that would be no. Does that mean what now? It is no longer taking that damage. Uh, In addition, other than the... Recent damage that, uh, light damage that was done to it in the hallway, it appears uh -huh. to be undamaged. All right, what? that's good to know. Uh, then I'm going to do this instead. <laughs> oh, right. Okay, three of the original tickets of yourself. Okay. So, yeah, there are four kins now. <laughs> I'm just going to drop a few of me on the, on the map. If it would let me. Yeah, okay, cool. Uh, roll 20 is frozen for me. <laughs> oh. Everything else is working fine. Yeah, reload. Wow. It's going real slow right now. Do anything. Oh, it's still populating. There we go, got it. Got it. Got it. Got it. All right. Cool. I'm done. <laughs>
Okay. Aurora, you're up. All right. Uh, oh my. <laughs> okay. Um. Eldritch Blast is four damage. Oh, no, it's so. gotten serious now. That's going to change the tide. Right? <laughs> we kind of need that, uh, that 20 of Eldritch Blast. Yeah. We'll see. <laughs> uh, okay. Yeah. Uh, all right. That okay. one is a miss. Okay. Okay. Um, yeah. That is also a miss. Okay. Yeah, this is a fun fight. <laughs> Anything else? Uh, I'm going to go back over here. Uh, I moved back over where I was standing more and just, yeah, that's it. Okay. <laughs> Norzugi, you're up. I believe you discovered a one in your inventory. Not if I'm not going to destroy all of of Ken's um, <laughs> mirror images. But AOEs don't affect my mirror images. Oh, really? Yeah. Okay. Then oh. remembering the I one in my prior <laughs> I guess I run past I run through his, you his, it. and I think I put this in here this okay I can okay no. No I need to actually pull out the spell idiot. Please don't break. Well, funny, don't break on me. Or they didn't attack you. I don't know if, if, where its body is. The may its head isn't actually part of its body right now. Well, its head is facing the original Ken and the Kenettes. Yeah. Basically, there's a lot of shimmering and shifting going on right now. Of course, Ken's beginning to feel a little uneasy given the fact that its head seems to be following the real Ken. <laughs> ah. Huh. It doesn't give me damage. Interesting. I guess I have to do that myself. Is that like or something? Huh. But yeah, dex, uh, 15 dexterity. Okay. What level did you cast it at? What the one? Yeah, level 3. That's a base level? Yeah, base. I don't know why. Really, this rule 21 doesn't actually grant grant actually roll of the of It damage. will, yeah. If, but you gotta have it set up. It, it matches the DC, damn it. Okay, so roll the damage. Okay, I I heat that it Wow. One charge is eight D six, that's pretty badass. Yeah it is. And it hits everyone within a line, a hundred yeah. foot line. Yeah. Nice. No, go Okay, so half of that's going to be eleven. Okay. Mm -hmm. Anything else? I stand here, I guess. Okay. 
Craig, you're up. Uh, well, YOLO? Uh, Reckless? Or do I get the advantage from where I'm at? Um, so where's the real Ken? It's huh. Ken. That would be where he would have shifted to. Okay. Then I'll say yes, you have the advantage. All right. 30? 30 will hit. That's 10 slashing, 7 radiant, and 10 necrotic. Go. 26? 26 does hit. 10 slashing, 7 necrotic. Okay. And finally. 30. Wait, do you have to alternate? No. Why would I need to alternate? Oh, but you don't know. No, so there's resistance to 27, the 27, okay. 40. So, the second attack was 10 slashing and 7 necrotic. The third attack was 15 slashing, 6 cold. I only get that radiant damage on the first attack that hits. Right. Cold? Where? From the frost brand. Frost? Oh, there. Okay, duh. For some reason, I didn't roll fully down. Okay. All right, hopefully you not have a bitch. Yeah, but we'll turn it in one shot, me, right? Okay. 2737. Yeah. <clears throat> have we seen him actually melee attack? 34, 54, 59. 65 points of damage. Nice. Yeah. Blackguard, you're up. As the dragon goes, ow! And is it on that curve? What? Is this space occupied? I think it is, but I'm yes. not sure how he's shaped. Yes. His okay. wing is kind of dangling out as he's trying to squeeze himself oh. down this tunnel. Wait, is the dragon not the only thing left? The dragon is technically not the only thing left. It is, however, the only thing left fighting you. Oh, okay. There's a 30-20? I don't think so. My 21 missed. Nope, that's a miss. <laughs> really? Yeah, my 21 missed him. <laughs> sure. Yep, I was like, uh-oh. <laughs> Well, I suppose that other dirty 20 won't do it. Nope. Well. But at least you're not, not hitting Craig in the back of the head. Not <laughs> happy. Um, okay. Done? Yes, so, I am done, yes. Wait. Uh, you would have had advantage on the attack. Would I? You would have. Yeah. He has enough. He has a whole lot of mirror images around him. Um, oh, okay. <laughs> the red dot is prime. Actually, I should, do, I should not do the red dot. That hey, what is it? On the first attack, let's use that crit. Okay. So, warble weapon. What's your ruling on this? Lots of damage. <laughs> Lots of damage. You would not uh, behead him, though. Not a surprise, so let me roll 68. And you're not actually facing the head. So let me go back here and do this. So let's remember that number 12 plus 68. Yep. And if you wanted to spike with your smite, this is the time. Uh, there's a 36. Don't forget to roll on the crit table. Uh, oh, that's right. Sorry, and then yeah, start good. start that process over. <laughs> oh no, never mind. It's the sixty eight. Go ahead. Okay. Uh, there's my three on the crit table. Dave, you get the crit table up, baby. Oh yeah, what, what did you get? A three. A three. A little, what is that? A pat on the ass. Uh. Usually, all right, what is it, a slashing? Uh, yeah. Slashing it. All right, yeah, normal so damage it and loses 1d6 hit points at the start of its next turn. So 
So a D12 and a D6 hit points lost. Well, it's not losing the D12 anymore, apparently. Oh, is it not? Okay. Um, all right, so... So what, what's damage? Your, what's the... So with the crit, or I'm sorry, with a, with a smite on there, it is uh, 12, 36 from the weapon. Okay. It is 9 uh, radiant from a smite. And then, uh, I was it on its turn, Dave, the D6, beginning of its turn? Yep. Mm -hmm. And yep. go ahead and so roll because the next turn is now. Okay, well, let me make sure I didn't let me confirm my second since I had attack uh, advantage. Oh, yeah. Uh, definitely still a miss okay. on the second attack. And that is... Oh, wait a minute. I also had a... a uh, smite? A branding smite in effect. Oh, you Next did? <laughs> I did. That was a crit. So that's 2d6. I was just doing the regular 2d6 for that, then, Tony, said, even though it was a, a uh, yeah. crit. <laughs> yep, yep. And uh, eight points of uh, what would that be? That's also radiant. Uh, he now sheds dim light and he can't become invisible. <laughs> Can I get dim light from my, my foolish turtle? So it's okay with me. I'm done. All right. I am no longer concentrated. Okay. He is now emitting dim light. He's shiny. Actually, I guess I do. I need to maintain my concentration for that effect. And he is bloody. And he can't go invisible. Not that he had any desire to, but he can. Right, we don't know. He may have spells. Let's, hey, hey, Let's see if he recharges his breath weapon. Yeah. That'll okay. be Oh, did you modify it so he doesn't have uh, as much of a cooldown on his breath weapon? I mean, he would have had to have gotten a five or a six. Five. All right. Here come these melee attacks. <laughs> oh, no. Oh, God. Oh, is that how recharge works? I thought it's like how many turns before he can use it again. Nope. If you get five or six, it's back. Oh, okay. Some stuff is a six, some stuff is a four through six. Just depends. Okay. Oh. He points a finger at Ken. For oh, real Ken. Yes, well. Let's see if Ken survives. Question. What level what level spellcaster is he? I uh, don't know. Then it would be based off of CR. <laughs> uh let's see. Ken must make a con saving throw. Uh huh. But what level, what level is he? So we know. But I don't think we would know. No, but no, it actually matters to my character. Right, but I don't think your character knows. Uh, well, it wouldn't matter. Is he yeah. is he a CR sixteen or higher? Yes. It doesn't affect me. Because of that oh, ring. The he ring he finally, yeah. he finally has something that their ring is saving him. <laughs> As he hear, hears the dragon whisper to him, die. And I go, Ooh. Ooh. and I, I bring both middle fingers up to him and say, you're not smart enough to know how to kill me. And you bite your arm off. <laughs> Yes. Well, there went his turn. <laughs> nope, he's not done yet. Oh, boy. 
That was the action in cast. Oh, yes, but... <laughs> he does have legendary actions. Eh, yeah, well, I have no idea what... I know that's not all right, but a four would miss me in terms of the role. Yeah. So, yeah, he misses you with that. <laughs> the ring finally came in. <laughs> um, He's about time. <laughs> how many times, like, how many times have I asked what level the, the caster at? Well, how level was <laughs> He is going to action surge? <laughs> and use this. All right, so uh, I get a bonus because I'm close to the paladin, right? Yeah, I do. Let's see. Yeah, no, yeah, you're way too far away from me to get that boost. Uh, it's a uh, plus two, Dave. Not the best, but three a little bit. It doesn't matter. Twenty-four. Damn. Uh. What is it again? Which say? Wisdom, Wisdom, sir. Wisdom. Come on, cat. Give it a rest. <laughs> 16. Okay. Oh, cool. On the money. For Zugi? There's an 120 feet. Ben? Yes. I'm actually uh, close enough for that. Yeah, uh, yeah, Oh. <laughs> okay. You made your save. In fact, the All only right. one that failed is Craig. Yep. Well, great, Craig fails. <laughs> Dang it. Uh, no, it's not that big of a deal. Yeah. It's not reckless. I mean, you don't even need a reckless. You're you're flanking with me. And you're up. Cool. Let's see if advantage helps. <laughs> 25 to hit. That does hit. Cool. Let me roll this then. Actually, I'm going to let me, let me uh, do all my hits and then I'll roll at the end. Now I know that misses. Fail. 22? Does just hit. Sweet. All right. So, twelve. Yeah, twelve thunder plus. Wait, how do you have have an offhand and a shield? Oh, right. Probably armor. Armor. Um, plus twelve. Plus, uh, what do we call it? Radiant. Uh, twenty points of radiant damage. Okay. Anything else? Uh, no, 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 no. I'm good. Aurora, you're up. Doki. Um. <laughs> I'm gonna stand on my brother for her for this. What? You, you could, could stand. You could stand beside me, and then we're <laughs> bad past at the same at the same rate. Meh. And on you. Okay. Okay. Oh. Oh, all right. Um. No, people will ride me. <laughs> I don't have the right one. I'm going to stand on you. Yeah. Um. I guess I'll try Eldritch Blast again. See, that's going to do it right there. That's, that's, that's I, yeah, all I got. I, I, I certainly hope so. Well, where it goes one. 22 yeah. is the what is what you have to make to hit this thing. Okay, that's gonna be fun. All right. Oh, well, okay. Well, uh, I. 
like finger guns just kind of went. Yeah, I know. <laughs> <laughs> All right, Gorzugi. All right, bonus action, Guardian of Nature, re um, B style. On and yourself. Okay. What? And what the fuck is with my character sheet? And I'm just going to close distance and smack him with my mace. Am I close enough? Yeah. And, and if and that doesn't yeah, hit, yeah, and yeah. I have nothing. Oh, sure. Can I can I just roll? I'll just do this again. And nope, I am stupid. <clears throat> Okay. And you know what? Since he's likely not getting away, can he do a con save? Even though I know this is resisted. Sure. Cool. He takes three necrotic. Yay. Actually, he takes no damage. Huh? Um, something, uh, uh, first, Bakgar, roll a perception okay. check. I'm gonna roll a perception check for you, boss. I'm gonna roll it so well, it's gonna dazzle you. Check that out. I go. Uh, Lockgar, you begin to realize yeah. that you're feeling heat off of this dragon, and things aren't actually acting the way it should. Heat? Yep. As in flames from the abyss. It's a fucking... Oh, this is what we've been looking for. Yes, there it is. So, is this a, a, a symbol that I should not... Be, I should stop my halo from hitting him? Well, you should definitely hit him. With my halo of necrotic. Yeah, the necrotic would have no effect on you. Oh, okay, yeah. Well, so, let's see. Then, if he's a fiend, then he would have been taking an additional D8 from my spikes. That is correct. Uh, How many is that? I think I did. Let me look at my spell slots. I think I did three. Let me look. Nope, there's one, two, three, four, and then the, well, that's five. No, I did one of those on the Ogre Magi. That's only, that's only four. Okay. Additional wow. 16, radiant. Okay. And as you're looking at the demon, uh, you begin to realize all the radiant damage that's been done has actually been doing more damage than had originally appeared. Oh. oh. Well, also, Craig is, is not afraid. And it is Craig's turn. Okay. Did I notice that the wasn't taking the necrotic damage? Yeah. Uh, you do now. Because at this point, it has shed its illusionary form. And well, you, but you, it does not matter because you're running away. No. Right. He's, if you're a brother. Even if I was still frightened, I wouldn't run away. No, oh, right. You just can't you can't get closer or nothing. Right. Thirty to hit? That'll hit. That's twelve slashing, six radiant, and five cold. So twenty three. Uh, did it take extra for the radiant? Uh, it took extra for the radiant. It took oh. half as much for the slashing. Ah, well, it is a magical weapon. I know. Okay. Does that have to be a silver weapon? It does have to be a, a magical weapon. It is a magical weapon. No, I'm responding to Ben's oh. question. Okay. Uh, 22 to hit. Does hit. That'll be 16 slashing and one cold. Okay. 
uh, all right, here the 27 for 12 slashing and 10 necrotic, which necrotic does nothing. Right. Okay. Lockar. Right. Uh, Showtime, Paladin. <laughs> Bonus action. I'll pull the last of my smite beads and cast it. It's the same one. It's the branding smite. Sure. And I will <clears throat> attack at advantage. Come on, Vorpal Greatsword. Let's get in the game here. Got it. Ooh. That is a critter. Okay. Let's get that so D20 out of the way. We'll do this in order. There's an <laughs> 8 on the D20 for the uh, crit table, Dave. D8? Oh yeah, and an eight, 8 slashing. Uh, open gash. Roll damage dice twice as normal if creature's bleeding. The next death creature loses 1D4 damage at the start of each of its turn. So that's a D6 and a D4 at the beginning of his turn. Unless, wait, but we don't actually understand why he stopped bleeding when the bleed time was a minute. Don't know. Yeah. So, so there's the roll on the table. Now I'll give you. I assume he's still too large in this form for a decapitation. Yes. All right. Then you just want the sixty-eight. Wait, right. when did Ken's true sight go uh, fall? I did it. So, so Ken but, always knew what this this dragon was. So there's the, thirty from the the dragon weapon. form was not an illusion. Oh, okay. I, I don't see, think that I, matters. I think Streetside will still see the original form, even if it's yeah. a polymorph. It, it, it's shape shifting doesn't matter. I see its true form. Wait, now, would Ken have told anyone anyway? <laughs> well, actually, no. It was not a concentration because then you cast wall force and then that went away, right? Uh, it's not. It's just Hey, then we're still on initiative here. Let's resolve my turn before we start a side discussion. Yep. We got 30 on the weapon okay. for the, the Vorpal, and we've got uh, 2D, so, so that's 5 radiant from the uh, branding spike. Okay. Or whatever else that does to him. Okay. And then I'm going to put a first level smite into it. And because he's a fiend, that's 3d8s for 13. Did you get the full radiant. crit? Uh, hey, wait, did you get the full crit as in you'd be doubling your dice as well? Did I just see the blood explosion of death? Well, I think it matters. Uh, <laughs> what does the table? I mean, I rolled my d20 on the table. I yeah. thought that's all we were following was the crit table once you roll the crit. Yeah. Well, I don't have access to access it. That is correct. Did I, I miss something the other day? Was it? Uh, it was roll your damage dice twice as normal if the creature is bleeding. Ah, thank you. Eric called it. Rolled twice. So there's that. Punch and... Yeah. Just out of curiosity, could you have switched to Radiant as your crit and on any of these? Uh, yeah, it is. The smites are crits. Or the 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 smites are Radiant. I'm just like, is, could you have rolled on the Radiant table? Uh, on the Radiant table, you roll, the, roll your damage as normal and creatures frightened until the end of its next turn. Oh, that's all. Oh, darn it. I thought it was one of the nicer ones, like Rachel's Mark. All right. That's well, still dead. Yeah. Oh, is it dead? Like, cool. Yeah, yeah. Like, you haven't even fully rolled all your, like, smite damage yet, and <laughs> you obliterated it. Hooray. Nice. I've still got another attack. It is again. <laughs> well, we have, Make sure we have someone unseen, so I hope Ken can see it. Hit it again. Make sure it's dead. Cleave, make sure to cleave off its head. Craig, what's your AC? I'm just kidding. 
Don't we have the one invisible one that Ken probably can see? Or the one that tried to run away? We still got things roaming the halls, too, don't we? Yeah. Some so, big nasties. Who's hurt? Uh, I've been I never... Ken has got pretty blasted, yeah. I thought. I ate another dragon breath. <laughs> okay. Who needs heals? Let's see. Dude, uh, chill. I need heals. Yeah. <laughs> we both need heals. I, I'm about right. 23 down. And by the way, you guys hear at this point kind of like lots of doors and stuff opening and footsteps uh, that seem to be fading away. Chip, Camaro. <laughs> <laughs> a cute healing word on to Ken because I witnessed his attack. His withstanding of the dragon. Yeah, I'm. I'm just actually. I'm. I'm about five down. So no, four down. Four down. Where, um, where do we hear the footsteps from? Yeah. Uh, they're just kind of echoing, and they get fainter as time marches on. Oh, yeah, the acid blast only did, like, what, four damage? Um, no, 22. Oh, well, then here, yeah, okay, you took my 14, all right. I was misunderstanding. The dwarf right. touched me into my no-no square. <laughs> that thing was a bitch. There's all the right, box. left on the ground. Yep. Anything left? Uh, there is stuff. Yeah. That's is it the magical stuff that was on them before we attacked? Yes. Ah. Uh, plus there's stuff laying on the ground at the feet of the demon body. Oh yeah. yeah. Let's search all that cute junk. Yeah, kinda. Well, let's be a bit more careful about the demon junk. <laughs> Anyone else need a long rest? <laughs> I have not taken damage since the last one. I uh, have no more spell slots. I, well, I, yeah, I, I just have to use an action and I have one more. I'm empty. Alright. Okay, and can Ken's and Ken can look at all the equipment and make sure none of it's like a mimic or shit. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I could. I can tell any item that's been changed by illusion or shape shifting. What are you still down? Me? Me? Or Craig? Craig. Craig. Oh, 13. Okay, so let's see. There was the Ring of X ray Vision. Ooh. That you guys actually were able to identify before all this battle started. Mm -hmm. And then, let's see. Yeah. My next step was to switch to healer mode and start using ointment to heal people. Oh, sorry. Um, I guess six health points to Craig. Anybody else still down? I'm down. I think Craig, you're down what six or seven? I'm I'm down four. Uh, I'm down seven. I'm good. Okay. I grab. I touched the magical spear. Touch your magic helmet with it. Magical cloak. Ooh, magic cloak. Oh no, I am interested in magic cloak. Spear with magic helmet. Magic quarterstaff. Uh, just, I just I only avoid the quarterstaff because I don't want to be Donatello. <laughs> we got fortunate with all those crit hits that you guys were pulling off. Magic totem. That has to be mine. <laughs> okay. That's the stuff that was in the room with the dragon slash demon. All right, now on the demon. <laughs> okay. Mm -hmm. All right.
Okay, even though I was excited about many of those things, I grab the totem and and have essay and envelop it in and fungus. Okay. Okay, that's the stuff. Box, spear, crossbow, cloak, staff, necklace, totem, hammer, mace, two rings, and a crown. Who wants to... Who, well, I mean, first off, I'm assuming none of them are like little mimics. <laughs> no. Uh, however, mm-hmm. I will note that the crown is actually on fire. Oh, I, I did. Dibs. Do you have I fire resistance? Fire. Yep. Or, yes, I do. Right. How about we just identify everything first, huh? Yeah, no, this one's trying to figure out what's what, what to be where. Like, oh. if, it, if the crown's on fire and none of you can see that, that makes me wary of it. <laughs> All right, but let's, I let's take I a, believe. let's take a break. I gotta use the mm-hmm. restroom. We'll come back and figure it all. Okay. Yep, yep. All right.